If you have an Exchange Online account, then you have a maximum amount of data that you can use. So let's see how much data you're using with your Outlook Exchange account. So I'm going to go to the settings in the upper right hand corner and the settings show up. And I'm going to go to where it says storage. And take a look, it says that according to my account, I've got 99 gigabytes of email storage that I can use. And I'm currently not using very much, but you're probably going to see many different gigabytes. So it'll also show you how much data that you have in each of these different categories. So for instance, if you've deleted a lot of folders, but you haven't emptied out your email, then you can go ahead and choose to empty that here very quickly. So you can choose anything three months or older, six months, 12 months or older, or all. So I'll just go ahead and choose all and that clears it out very quickly. The old way of doing it is to select all of the emails and then hit the delete key, which can take a really long time. And you may not see that the message count goes away right away. You might have to refresh the screen and then it'll eventually go down to zero. Unless of course you chose one of these other options. And you can do that for each one of your different folders if you'd like. If you have more than one account, you can also choose from that drop down your other account. And you can see I've got more data in this particular one. And I can choose to empty that out if I'd like, which I would. And now that's gone as well. So that's how you check to see how much storage you have and how to empty messages if needed in Outlook 365.